As you often heard me say already, because of a garden party in the middle of the lockdown, Boris Johnson is under massive pressure and the opposition is demanding his resi resignation. But I have to talk th about this over and over again because new things happen. Because now his most important corona advisor is leaving the British government. So, in the midst of what is possibly his worst political crisis, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson has lost another key employee. Health advisor Jonathan Van Tam has surprisingly announced his retirement from politics. The epidemiologist has become one of the most recognizable faces in the UK government during the pandemic. Serving the public during the coronavirus pandemic was the greatest privilege of his career, Van Tam told journalists on Thursday. And Health Minister Sajid Javid acknowledged Van Tam's pioneer role in the fight against the virus and was endlessly grateful. Van Temp will continue in his government post until the end of March, after which he will return to the University of Nottingham as a researcher. Van Temp's retirement comes at a bad time for Johnson. The Prime Minister admitted in Parliament on Wednesday that he admitted a garden party at Downing Street during lockdown in May 2020. Johnson said he mistook the party for a work meeting, which in retrospect was wrong. Johnson's office manager had invited to the event and asked the guests to bring their own booze. And if you want to see, if you think those are work meetings, have a look at my Twitter. I posted a work meeting photo there as well. The opposition in Parliament called for Johnson's resignation, but the Prime Minister is also under massive pressure from his Tories. We now know that the Prime Minister spent 25 minutes at what was clearly a party. That means he misled Parliament. And frankly speaking, he lied to Parliament. Tory MP Roger Gale told the misled part, not the lie part, to the BBC. He's now a dead man walking, they say. The leader of the Scottish Conservatives, Douglas Ross, also called on Johnson to resign. And few Tories publicly supported the Prime Minister. Minister of Culture Nadine Dorries called for the results of an ongoing internal investigation to be awaited. Johnson himself had referred to these investigation when the opposition in Parliament asked him to resign. But this is an internal party investigation. We're talking here about an, an office of that country and not of the party. And uh, Jacob Rees-Mogg was even more funnier today. I put under his Twitter um, today and the, uh, the, the World Comedy Award goes to because he says the, the investigation might come to the outcome that the rules were too strict. And that's why it's no, not a problem to do that. Seriously, JRM is getting funnier every day. I'll see you in my next video. Bis gleich.